You're watching Statistics Made Simple and I am Savita Welsung. In this video, I'll discuss about the control chart for attributes and in particular the NP or D chart for number of defectives. Previously, I have explained about control chart for variables where we learned the X bar or the mean chart and the R chart which is the range chart. Now let me explain the NP or D chart for number of defectives. Now in some cases we want to assess whether a certain item is defective or not. So suppose we have k samples each of size n and d is the number of defectives in each of these samples. Then d that is the number of defectives will follow binomial distribution with mean np and standard deviation root npq and is written as d follows binomial within brackets you write np and root npq where P is the proportion of defectives in the sample or it's also called as a fraction defective of the sample and is given by P equal to D divided by N. Starting with case 1 when the process standard is known that is capital P which is the population proportion which is also known as the proportion of defectives in the population is known or it is given to us. Let us assume that the population proportion that is capital P is equal to some P dash. Then the three sigma control limits are CL is equal to NP dash, UCL is equal to NP dash plus three times root NP dash Q dash where Q dash is equal to one minus P dash. Similarly, the LCL that is the lower control limit is NP dash minus 3 times root NP dash Q dash where Q dash is equal to 1 minus P dash. So Q dash is called as the proportion of non-defectives in the population. Case 2 when the process standard is unknown that is capital P the population proportion or the proportion of defectives in the population is unknown. Then the three sigma control limits are given by CL is equal to NP bar, UCL is equal to NP bar plus three times root NP bar Q bar where Q bar is equal to 1 minus P bar, LCL is equal to NP bar minus 3 times root NP bar Q bar, where Q bar is equal to 1 minus P bar. Here, P bar is used as an estimate for P, which is based on a sample and is given by P bar is equal to summation D divided by NK. Thank you all for watching and look out for my next video where I'll find solutions to problems based on the control chart for defectives that is the D chart.